Troy has hired a new head football coach. It is Gerald Parker, who was the OC at Notre Dame, as well as the tight ends coach. But I want to still go over his background. He is 42 years old. He played at Kentucky from 2000 to 2004 as a wide receiver. But his coaching career began at Race Worthington High School in Kentucky from 2005 to 2006 as a wide receiver slash defensive backs coach. 2007, he went back to his alma mater as a, as a GA, a grad assistant, basically. 2008 to 2010, he was at UT Martin as a passing game coordinator slash re recruiting coordinator. He was at Marshall afterwards from 2011 to 2012 as a wire series coach. And he was at Purdue from 2013 to 2016, but he had different roles. Like the first two seasons, he was a tight ends coach and recruiting coordinator. 2015 to 2016, he was the wire series coach slash recruiting coordinator. Then he became the interim coach once they fired D Daryl Hazel. I mean, for the final six weeks, he was an interim head coach. So, yeah, and then he went to Duke right after that for two years as a operations assistant and wide receivers coach. Then he went to Penn State right afterward. Earns for a wire series coach for one year in 2019. 2020 to 2021, he was an offensive coordinator slash wire series coach at West Virginia. Then he was in Notre Dame the last two years. The first year as just a tight ends coach, and this past year as an OC, I know, and slash tight ends coach. I know some Notre Dame fans were not really happy, or at least some of them, with his off being an offensive coordinator and all that. So. And he did lose all his six games as an interim, by the way, at Purdue. I don't know how much better could Troy could have done, to be honest. And it is a risk to take on a head coach, a take get a new head coach with no experience whatsoever. But at least he's starting from the group of five level and not him getting a power five job or anything like that. I would call it at least a decent hire, but we're going to wait and see and what his staff looks like and the roster as well because you know the transfer portal because their head coach left to Tulane. Yeah. Makes a lot of sense on why those players left at the time. And I would give him three to five years and we know that Troy is in the Sun Belt. So, we'll just have to wait and see what happens from here and what his staff looks like, like I said, in his roster. So, anyways, if you like this content, like and subscribe, and see you guys later on the road of 600 subscribers. Of course, our ultimate goal is a thousand more, so make money off this course. Like and video, comment and video really helps YouTube algorithm so more people can see it. Sharing the video does help as well, so more people could watch. And if you're watching and not subscribed, hit subscribe button. It's free, hit the notification bell as well.